Hey guys, it's Katie with Factory Direct Crafts, and today I'm going to show you how to make these macrame wooden utensils. What you're going to need for this project is a wooden utensil, some macrame cord or some white baker's twine, and a pair of scissors. So once you get your materials together, let's go ahead and get started. I absolutely love this project because it's a super inexpensive way to kind of update your old, just plain wooden utensils. Uh, so the first step is cutting a piece of this kind of baker's twine. So I'm going to cut a really long piece, about, about five or six feet. And now it's okay if you have some extra. You just want to make sure you have enough to get as far down the handle as you'd like to. So I'm going to go ahead and just cut that. Just like so. And then I'm going to go ahead and find the middle of the piece I cut. Oh. There we go. And I'm going to lay my wooden utensil right on the center. Okay, the next step is tying a super tight knot around the top. And this is just, I'm going to flip it over so it's backwards, just a regular knot. And this is just to hold the top of your string and your macrame in place. There we go. Nice and tight. Okay, flipping this back over to the front. Now comes the part, um, I'm going to teach you how to do the knot, and this is the step you'll be repeating all the way down the wooden handle. So the first step is you want to take the left side and make a number four and cross it over the top of your wooden handle. Then with the piece on, on the right side, you're going to make a four going in the opposite direction going under. So now I've got these two loops. Then I'm going to take this string, pull it through this right loop, and then I'm going to take this, this string and pull it up through this loop, and pull this up nice and tight on my handle, just like so. Okay, I'll show you that one more time. So you cross the left side over like a four, then we cross the right side underneath the handle. Just like that, creating those two loops. And now I'm going to bring this rope down through this loop. And I'm going to bring this side up through this loop. And then I'm going to pull it nice and tight. Okay, so you're just going to go ahead and keep repeating this step all the way down the handle. And as you can see, it's kind of making this, I'll show you on this one that I've done a little further way down. It's going to make this kind of crisscross pattern. Super cute. Okay, and I will check back in with you once I've gotten as far as I'd like to macrame down my wooden handle. So once you finish your macrame almost all the way to the bottom, you're going to go ahead and tie it off. So to do that, you're just going to tie a double knot. nice and tight and then you're gonna go ahead and trim the excess and there you have it now care for this these can be washed by hand um, be careful not to get this soaking wet but if you get it a little wet it's okay um, but yeah the best way is to just submerge the top in water a little dish soap on there is good and you are good to go. Anyways, that is how you make your macrame covers for your wooden utensils. I hope you guys have a lot of fun with this project. Thanks for watching.